The official stripes of going against the grain. Promark. I know you do something uh, kind of interesting with your sticks. You have, are you playing the 420Xs? These are the 420Xs. Okay. My, my original sticks with Promarks were 420s. Uh, which is my birthday, April 20th, uh, amongst, other, amongst other things. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, you know, those, the, when I created those sticks about 25 years ago, I was solely playing with Dream Theater, doing very progressive technical music. So I, want, I used a very th thin, light stick. So, but then once uh, I started playing with all different bands after Dream Theater, some of which were heavier, you know, metal, what I do with Metal Allegiance or Avenged Sevenfold or Twisted Sister or Sons of Apollo, anything that's a little bit more hard rock or heavy. Uh, I wanted a heavier stick, so we developed the 420X, which are a little heavier, a little bigger, and they also have the uh, active grip, mm -hmm. uh, but I, I do use stick wrap as well. And another thing about my sticks that I've always played uh, is I play with the left stick with the butt end out yep. and the right stick with the tip out. And the point, reason for that is mainly to get power on the snare with the butt end, but I, I don't like playing the right stick with the butt end out because it sounds a little dull on the cymbals. So for the hi hat and ride work, uh, you know, the right stick is with the tip out, so you can get a little more definition on the on the cymbals with the, with the ride and hi hat. And uh, yeah, that, that also means that my drum tech has to wrap half the sticks this way and half the sticks that way. And they also have to sit in the stick bag <laughs> broken into left and right. And if I drop a stick or throw, throw away a stick during a show, I have to make sure I'm picking up a the left right, or a yeah, right. Yeah, you know? the right one or the left one. Exactly. Which is the wrong one. Right. The right one or the wrong one or the left one or the correct one, something like that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, that's awesome. It just continues with your uh, theme of balance. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I am very, very OCD. As much as I'm not, like I was just saying, I'm not a gearhead in terms of, oh, it has to be, you know, you know, it's 16 inch depth or whatever. I'm not like that, but I am very OCD in terms of organization and the, you know, the, the way that things are laid out and, you know, my drum tech is, is very, you know, we have a very consistent routine, everything from, you know, where the drinks go, you know, what I'm handed during the show at the, what point in the show, my mic swinging. I mean, I, I sing in almost all my bands, but, uh, you know, uh, my drum tech actually is the one that's swinging the mic back and forth throughout the show. Uh, so, you know, he has to know those cues. It's, it's a pretty detailed gig for, for my tech. You yeah. Know? Yeah. They, they, there's a lot of OCD details that I'm very like, I need consistency with from night to night.